how are you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. It is Kitty here. Today we're doing a room build. I have seen so many people do like Sims videos on dorm rooms and I have made one apartment to be like a dorm but I decided I wanted to make more dorm rooms and I decided to make them as rooms. It's gonna be the first one. I can continue this depending on if you guys like it or not. So definitely tell me in the comments if you want to see different themed dorm rooms. This one is going to be a girly girl room. Obviously I started with that one as it is like my style. I went super cute and pink on this one and I really love how it turned out. So this room is very small. It's like definitely trying to represent a room in a dorm. So it's just a, like a, what's that shape? Not a square, but like a rectangle, is that the shape? So it's like, it's only three wide and I don't know how long, it's like six maybe long, is it long? I don't know, but it's very tiny and I wanted to use a bunk bed in here for sure to add a little bit more space. I do have myself shit sim in a second in here to test that everything is working as it wasn't at first but I did test everything in the end and you can use every single item in this room as intended. This room is super cluttered just so you know like I don't know maybe I went a bit crazy because maybe it's not um realistic but I wanted to put as much stuff as I could in here and still that the sims could use it so I tried to just make it very cluttered in the sims not as much like in real life I don't think you would have this much stuff and it doesn't really make sense but it works and I was just so like I don't know excited how much I could make work in this tiny space so I just had to shove like everything in there that I could so we actually have a computer desk and then the vanity table on the opposite sides of the room like right like next to each other and I don't think in real life you would have two desks in a space like this you would definitely do your makeup at the same desk you have like your laptop or whatever or just do it anywhere else in front of the mirror or something but I put a vanity table in here because I thought if this was gonna be a girly girl room it was gonna have a vanity table so I put it in there I don't know what you guys are gonna think but at least it works computer works the bed works TV works there's a little bookshelf that works you have a wardrobe you have everything in here and I also added a sink in this room because in some dorm rooms you like oh or like in all dorm rooms, you share bathrooms with like everyone who lives in that dorm and showers. But in some dorm rooms, everyone has like a sink in their own little dorm room so that maybe you can like brush your teeth, you know, and get water or whatever without having to go to the public like bathroom. So I did add a sink in here, at least in the one dorm room that I have ever stayed in. There was a sink and it was really like useful. You could wash your face and even your hair in the sink if you wanted. <laughs> I don't know. I haven't washed my hair in the sink in forever, but I did used to do that sometimes when like there was another option or something. I don't re remember why, but I have washed my hair in the sink. Not the easiest thing, but it's not too hard. <laughs> Anyways, we have the TV under the bed on this cute marble side table and I even put some plushies in this room because I thought they were so cute and I love plushies so I was like, why not? We have candles, we have posters, we have that cute wall decor item from Kids Room Stuff Pack that is the fairy lights that have like little pictures or Polaroids hanging from them behind the computer and I really really, really really love that item. I had to put it in here, I definitely thought it would be perfect for a dorm and then we put in a little radio even. I think the thing that I just put down is a little radio so you even have that in here. And now we're shoving in the vanity table and like I said it does work, it doesn't look very practical <laughs> so I don't know if I regret putting it there but I'm just happy how much I could make work in such a tiny space so I thought it was a Okay, we actually move it or we scoot it to the left a little bit so it's actually right opposite from the computer table so the chairs are like right opposite from each other but the sims can use them and move them back a little bit and sit there and I was gonna put it in a full body mirror but then I was like oh yeah we don't actually have almost any like storage space in here and we need like a wardrobe so I put in the little wardrobe from Vintage Glamour stuff pack and it fit and like I can't believe how much fit in here <laughs> it's so cluttered maybe that if I make more rooms like this they won't be as cluttered for sure obviously 
like they're meant to be a bit cluttered and tight for space because there are small rooms and you basically live here so you have all your stuff in this tiny room but I think I went a little bit too overboard but I do like how it turned out it turned really turned out really really cute and it has lots of different things and definitely lots of things to like use in this room and not be bored and I as a couch or like little lounge chairs I'm using those two little poofs or whatever I don't know two little pink ones they're from Spotty I think maybe I don't remember anymore but you can sit there when you want to watch the tv you can even have a friend over I put a little towel on top of the other one to just make it look a bit more cluttered but obviously if this was real life you could just move it I don't know if your sims would st sit on top of it maybe they would but it <laughs> doesn't really matter that mirror would have been so cute in here I love the little flowers on it it's also from the kids room stuff pack but I do end up taking that out and swapping it for the wardrobe and this is the vanity table, oh my god, so much trouble trying to put items on it because I didn't want to move the table because it was like in the perfect spot where it worked. So I was like, if I move the table, I might mess the whole thing up. So I'd rather just clutter the whole thing, all the available little things. And then I was able to move the items and I found this uh, little makeup or eyeshadow or contour kit, whatever it is. <laughs> from the debug menu and I of course had to put it in here there's also a little lip balm and there was like an eyeliner pencil but that looked really weird so I did not, did not use that but I did use this nail file as well so definitely lots of clutter on this little vanity table as well but I thought that was realistic so definitely had to use that oh and we're also using the freaking pink unicorn door like I don't know don't ask me I just wanted to use it and it's freaking cute so why not I mean this room is maybe a little bit kitty or like because there's also plushies and stuff around but I thought it was cute and I wanted to do it so I did it don't judge me and yes that bookshelf does work your sims can take books from there the sink work actually I didn't test if the sink works but I see no reason why it wouldn't work you have a little laundry basket under the sink because why not maybe you couldn't really actually reach that unless you moved some items around or those little chairs but oh well it doesn't really matter and that mirror is from Vintage Glamour Stuff Pack. It's my favorite. And then we're just adding a few more posters uh, where the bed is, I think. There's also lots of flowers in this room and it's just very, very cute. I really, really like it. So if you want to download this room, I will put it on the gallery. My gallery origin ID is SimmerKittenYT or you can also find it under the hashtag SimmerKitten. There's a bunch of stuff there now under the hashtag. I was just looking at it the other day. Really nice creations from you guys, but Definitely you can find it under my username, which is always in the description if you want to download anything of mine. So here you go, we're just moving some rugs around, putting that little pink fur rug in there. And what else do I do? Oh yeah, we use this little shelf from the kids room stuff pack and we just put it on top of the wardrobe. So it kind of just looks like there's a little picture of that. Is that a cat? I think it's a cat. Cat with a mustache and a bow and it's adorable. So I was like, yes, that looks perfect. And that little plushy thing on top of the wardrobe as well it's so cute anyways here are the screenshots now i hope you guys enjoyed tell me if you want to see more dorm rooms or any other kind of speed builds give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed subscribe if you haven't already and yeah I hope you guys are having a super awesome day. I will see you guys again tomorrow for a townie makeover Tuesday and <laughs> again every single day after that. Hope you guys are having a great day. Thanks so much for watching and bye-bye.